What are the main challenges facing the widespread adoption of smart grids? One of the main challenges is the massive increase in data volume. Up to 900% more data is generated and that needs to get analyzed in order to provide the ROI to utilities. The second point are customers who lack the engagement and have initial worries about security and privacy. The third point is a more pan-European alignment in energy policies in order to give the guarantee to utilities in larger smart grid uh, rollouts. Oracle Utilities has produced a Future of Energy report which details the electricity issues and trends that will combine to make the smart grid and a low carbon economy a reality by 2050. So what are the highlights of that report? The Oracle Future of Energy report focuses on three main stakeholders. First, making sure the right technology, standards and uh, nudge technologies are adopted by utilities to have fast result. The second point is to focus on customer awareness, on customer adoption and the customer engagement. We have seen that in projects with the availability of a smart grid and the benefits customers can realize, that recognition of customers is well taken up. The third point is focused on policies and it demonstrates that nudge adjustments in the policies have helped in the rollout of smart grid and smart meter programs. So talk us through the economics of smart grids. What are the key things that utilities should know? Smart grids and smart meters are focused towards two main objectives. First, making the utility operation more efficient. Second, providing customers means of understanding their consumption and reducing ultimately their consumption. As it relates to the first point, making utility operation more efficient, the smart grid allows utility to manage the energy flow within their networks more efficiently, to increase the feed-in of renewable and low carbon energy to a maximum, and thirdly, to dispatch and deploy their internal resources in the network more efficiently. For customers, smart meters and smart grid will give the visibility about their private consumption and will offer more choice to customers as it relates to when and how much energy they choose to consume. What do energy suppliers need to do to fully benefit from the smart grid revolution? Energy suppliers will receive for the first time and real-time information about their customers. They will have an almost immediate and real-time communication with their customers, which allows them to offer first new products, new services, and have a much tighter uh, loyalty with their customers. That allows retailers not only to provide a commodity, but added value services to their consumers. In order to achieve that, suppliers need to understand customer patterns, customer behavior, and the smart grid and smart meter infrastructure will provide that insight. And over what time scale? Are we looking ahead decades or can energy suppliers start benefiting from the smart grid sooner? The rollout of smart meters and smart grid is a gradual evolution. We have seen in many projects that utilities are rolling out smart meters and smart grid technologies by a business case oriented approach, meaning that the return on investment for utilities is best if it's rolled out on purpose. We're talking about a timeline which spans over the next five to ten years to have the core technologies deployed in order to have a full deployment that will take longer, but again, the benefits can be achieved by a very uh, targeted rollout first. Now, for the most part, consumers still aren't aware of smart grids. What do you think might win the argument at a customer level, and what can energy suppliers do in order to better educate consumers? Often, customers are not informed and educated about the new possibilities smart meters are offering. It is not only about consuming energy in the same way as before. It is about 
adopting new services and benefiting from those new services, such as combine the integration of combined heat cycle uh, generation, the integration of photovoltaic, or the uptake of electric mobility. All of those new added value services are possible and can be managed with the availability of smart meters and smart grids. So where does Oracle Utilities fit into the picture? What benefits would utilities receive from using your smart grid and smart metering solutions? Oracle Utilities is a technology provider. What's important is a smart grid is not only about assets. It is assets plus information plus processes. And Oracle Utilities provides the intelligence within the infrastructure coming out of the data provided by the infrastructure, but also managing the processes in the rollout of smart meters, in the engagement with customers, as well as managing their own resources in the most efficient way. Bastian Fischer, thank you very much. You're welcome.